Godzilla 1998 massive rant coming your way. Uh, a massive Godzilla rant. How could we not mention these two in the same sentence, massive and Godzilla? But rant is going to be included in there due to 1998's Godzilla. Uh, Matthew Broderick here. I just uh, Matthew was going through something in the 90s, right? They were flinging him out. He was in the cable guys in this movies, and now we say throw him right in your face uh, when it comes to Godzilla, and he just doesn't do the role for me. I want someone else, a little more beefier, a little more tougher, a little more heroic here to go head head on with Godzilla, so to speak. Uh, and Godzilla, of course, doesn't bring it because you barely see Godzilla. I remember seeing a lot of commercials for this shit, a lot of fast food restaurants endorsing it, whoever trying to get their hands on the Godzilla product because it really this is the first big Godzilla movie to come out in a long time. Really amplified hype for this film, and it just let it down so bad. All you do is see this eye shot that we've seen before, like in Jurassic Park. Keep the monster in the dark, which is a bad thing when you're dealing with creature features. I want to see the creature, and when you do see the Godzilla, it's so lame and just cheesy CGI bullshit. Uh, you know, nothing creative about Godzilla, and no good story either backing Godzilla to come out of the woodworks and shit and kill the city. Uh, he barely does it. You don't see any blood or guts. Too bad. You should have went one way or the other. Don't stick in the middle, because you will tread lightly, and that's the problem here. You want to tread hard and rough when you got Godzilla. They failed. Back in 98, massive rant. Godzilla, don't check it out. Oh, it's Godzilla! He's coming!